In the record of Moses speaking to God in the burning bush, Exodus 3, he asked God what his name was. God replied, I am who I am. Verse 14. It means, I have always existed and am the only non-created being ever. Jehovah is not in the Bible. When the Jews were writing their copies of the Old Testament Bible, when they had to write the holy name of God, they would stop and wash their hands before writing the holy name. So reverent were they towards the holiness of God. The actual words were known as the Tetragrammaton, as it consisted of four consonants, Yod, He, Va, He. It really has no meaning in Hebrew. The name of God was so holy to the Jews that they never pronounced it when reading the Bible in public. They always substituted the name Adonai, which equals Lord. To remind themselves to say it when reading aloud, they would not write the consonants of the word Adonai in the text, as this would be adding words to the Bible, which was forbidden. So they just wrote the vowels for Adonai in the consonants of the Tetragrammaton itself. When combined with the consonants, they formed the sound Yahevohe, which is usually pronounced in English as Jehovah. However, as can be seen, it is only as a result of combining two words, the consonants of one word with the vowels of another, that results in a word that is not strictly an original Hebrew word at all. Jehovah's Witnesses are very insistent that in order to worship God rightly, we must use his correct name, Jehovah, when addressing him. However, examination of the original words in the Old Testament Hebrew shows that this word does not appear in the texts. It is the combination of the consonants of one word with the vowels of another and then made into an anglicized word. <laughs>